what I learned from the iDesign project design master's class was not only how to put a project together from an architectural design, but also what, what actually makes that project work and, and how, do you, how do you have enough familiarity, familiarity with what's actually happening in the project to know where to turn the knobs and where to actually fine tune because I think you've all did a, a very good job of, of making sure that the five days that we had covered um, not only you know, all the tools and, and processes and, um, that we need to put together a project, but he also laid out the thought processes and the, the, the paradigm and the approach that you have to take in order to make these things successful to calculate risk, to be able to quantify risk, to be able to um, to show how various project design options differ in risk um, is is a huge advantage because I have I have executives that ask me all the time, well, when we have these different options, well, what is the difference in the risk between these? Because we don't want to invest in an option that is maybe more aggressive, but that has a higher chance that it's actually not going to fail. So being able to quantify that is um, so I haven't. I've not seen that um, in any other classes that I've taken, so that's been a huge advantage. Sometimes you've all get so deep on the material that you wonder if you'll ever be able to do it yourself, and then somehow when you do the mini clinic, it comes together so well that you realize that when he says it's a mechanical process, other than the, the one element of design and creativity that has to be in there, the rest of it's mechanical, you, you experience it for yourself. Um, and it, it, it's amazing how it comes together and how you get the confidence that you could actually take this home and next week apply it and the next day apply it because it's that straightforward. You know, after seeing Yuval present once or twice, you, you really get a feel for um, how, how much thought he's put into his classes and how deep he's gone on his material. The content that you get at a at a conference like this compared to another conference is, is so rich and dense that uh, you know that material um, that material can be consumed and digested for a very long time. I feel like I'm more empowered in a way that I wasn't before to actually sit in a room with my peers um, and with my business leaders and to be able to uh, demonstrate and explain with data. Um, what will actually occur in the project if we take different options, which is something that I don't think I was able to do before I got here a week ago. I had some expectations of the class, having talked with you all before we came into it, but I had no idea how deep it was going to go. And I had, it, it exceeded my hopes and expectations um, in, in almost every way. Um, I, I'd come in expecting to be able to measure and calculate, um, and you've all left me with a, a way to think and look at the problem, which is so much more than I hoped for. It's probably been one of the best classes I've ever been to. Next to his other class, the Architects Master's class. What I can do now is be more successful in the projects that I'm responsible for.